Westmacott, and I'm the chair of the Oglethorpe County Library Board. And as of Thursday, so like five minutes, I'm now <laughs> chair of the Board of Trustees for the Athens Regional Library System. Um, and I want to greet all of you for being here this afternoon. Thank you so much for coming. Um, let me put my glasses on here. Okay. Thank you, Val, for inviting me to speak to everyone assembled here to honor the Athens Regional Library System for receiving the award for, as the Georgia Public Library of the Year. And I'd like to add that this is the first time a multi-branch library system has received this recognition, which is quite an honor. The application for this was submitted through the efforts of Rhiannon Eads, Donna Brumby, Lorena Griffith, and Valerie Bell, with the addition of many letters of support from staff, board members, friends, and patrons across our region. This afternoon, you will hear of the efforts of all those who comprise the staff, boards, and friends organizations that make our library system work so well. But I'd like to take this opportunity to thank and recognize the contributions of our regional director, Valerie Bell. <laughs> Valerie, or Val, as she likes to be called, applied for the position a little over two years ago, along with several other candidates. The library system was in great shape, thanks to the long and able tenure of Catherine Ames. <laughs> well, I might add, made a very tough act to follow <laughs> for anyone. Um, Dennis Hopper, let's raise your hand, a member of our regional board of trustees, summed up the feelings of the entire board when he told me the following. Bringing in a new leader to such a complex endeavor as our regional library system was a challenge we, the Library Board of Trustees members, faced with some trepidation. The stakes were high and the process of hiring was very complicated. I am very pleased to say that we made the right choice. We brought in exactly the right person at the right time and she has proven to be the leader we envisioned. Valerie Bell has brought to our library new ideas, a quick understanding of community needs, a great imagination, intelligence, and a new energy. With her guidance, we look forward to a bright, bright future for the Athens Regional Library System. I need to add that Val would be the first to insist that an honor like the Georgia Public Library of the Year Award is the result of the combined efforts of everyone involved, and that is true. However, it seems to me that Val has provided the spark to ignite so many of the library's accomplishments, whether with the vibrant community grants, the EBSCO, the EBSCO solar grant, internet upgrades, new marketing efforts, and the lovely new logo unifying all our libraries and friends organizations in our regional system. She enthusiastically supports and encourages staff development opportunities. The events and programs she has championed encourage appreciation for diversity, inclusivity, and an appreciation for cultural identities and differences. She and her staff are creating partnerships with a wide variety of community groups from the athens Clark County Recycling Division, who's hosting the Green Life Expo, excuse me, the Big Read with the Georgia Museum of Art, the Hunger Bowl and Stuff the Bus with the Northeast Georgia Food Bank and Athens Transit, and Val will be also co-chairing the second annual Jeanette Rankin It's Time to Talk forums on race at the UGA State Tate Student Center on March 19th. As Lorena Griffin explained about Val, she is aware of the importance of the relationship between public relations and the community's views of the library system. 
The redesigned logo and the Reimagine Your Library campaign have put the library in view as a fresh and professional organization. Her emphasis on diversity and inclusion has created and continues to create a welcoming environment for staff and customers alike. The wide range of lifestyles and needs in the regional community has led to strategic partnerships and is always a consideration when planning. Her open-minded approach to the changes in librarianship allows Athens Regional Library System to offer cutting edge and innovative programming and services. It has become evident to me that for Valerie Bell, engaging communities and exceeding expectations are not catch phrases that simply sound good. They are words that she enacts every day in the Athens Regional Library System and words she lives by. Thank you. Wow, thank you, Jean. That was absolutely wonderful. <laughs> um, I want to welcome everyone. Welcome and good afternoon. My name is Valerie Bell, and it is my pleasure to be the director of the Athens Regional Library System. The Athens Regional Library System is made up of 11 branches throughout five counties, and our vision of library service is engaging communities and exceeding expectations. We are here today to celebrate the library and all we do throughout our communities and in service to every resident within the region. But we do not work in a vacuum, and our success is not due to just one or two people. One of my catchphrases is, it, it, um, teamwork makes the dream work. And so I'm going to introduce you and bring up on the stage now our administrative team. Come on up, you guys. Now I'd like to call to the podium our newly elected state representative, Deborah Gonzalez. Good afternoon. I can't tell you how proud I am of this library and this library staff. Will you please give them another round of applause? A few weeks ago, I was privileged to have a conversation with Val and Donna, and you know, I thought I knew about the library, but there is so much more that we never see that they do for our community. And so when I first got the news that they were ranked Library of the Year, and they happened to be in my district, I knew that I had to show that pride. And so I have here a proclamation. Valerie, will you please come up? And I'm sorry that it's not very nice, but with the snow, so the nice one's coming next week. <laughs> it's it's going to be here. The most important thing is that we got the resolution passed. Commending and honoring the Athens Regional Library System for being recognized by the Georgia Public Library Service as the 2017 Library of the Year, and for other purposes, we present this resolution. Whereas the Athens Regional Library System demonstrates the very best in innovation programs and community engagement to the thriving communities served. And whereas staff, librarians, and advocates of the Athens Regional Library System work together to offer creative programming and exemplary customer service and display a commitment to serving the entire population through the creation of a warm and welcoming space dedicated to learning and entertainment. <laughs> and whereas the Athens Regional Library System serves five Northeast Georgia counties, Athens Clark, Franklin, Madison, Oconee, and Oglethorpe, at 11 branches that positively impact the lives of community members and create lasting community partnership, and whereas the Athens Regional Library System is the first multi-library system to be recognized as Georgia's Public Library of the Year, and whereas it is abundantly fitting and proper that the outstanding accomplishments of this extraordinary public library system be appropriately recognized, therefore, be it resolved by the House of Representatives 
that the members of this body commend and honor the Athens Regional Library System for being recognized by the Georgia Public Library Service as the 2017 Library of the Year and the efforts of his staff, librarians, and advocates for the outstanding community service and extend sincere best wishes for continued success in exceeding expectations, be it further resolved that the clerk of the House of Representatives is authorized and directed to make an appropriate copy of this resolution available for distribution to Valerie Bell, director of the Athens Regional Library System. Thank you. <laughs> You know, our, our public library system is one of the things that makes this country strong, and it, it really is a great equalizer of knowledge and education, uh, and it's, it's the way you give every citizen a chance to thrive and succeed, and I, I, I learned as a young child, I was a, a bookworm when I was young, I grew up in Macon, uh, our library system there was great, they had a bookmobile that would come around in the summer, and you had a little program where you read Two bucks a week, you got or two books a week, you got like a gold star or something. I always was one of those kids that each summer was doing my summer reading program. You know, it makes you so much more diverse and interesting and knowledgeable about different subjects when you unlock that key to learning by learning how to read. And uh, you know, that seems like ancient times now with really books now. With all the computers, you know, your IT guru here can, can show me things that I don't understand. That the, the, the libraries are so much more modern, and, and I've always been happy uh, when I could deliver for funds for the expansion here, uh, out in Oconee and Bogard, and, and anything we can do to make this system stronger, I'll continue doing my best. But thank you for all these people that put in the, the hard elbow grease and work to, to make the system work for our community. We should be very proud of the system. Thank you. Our next guest needs no introduction, <laughs> but I'm going to say something anyway. Uh, as state librarian, Julie Walker leads the Georgia Public Library Service, a unit of the Board of Regents of the University System of Georgia and the State Agency for Georgia's Public Libraries. Previously, Julie has served as the Deputy State Librarian, <laughs> the Assistant State Librarian for Technology Support Services and Strategic Initiatives, and the Director of the Pines Program. Prior to joining the GPLS team in 2003, Julie was the Associate Director of the Athens Regional Library System. Yeah. Julie lives here, in, lives here in Athens, is a graduate of Leadership Athens, served on the Clark County School District, Parent Advisory Board, and as former chair of the Historic Preservation Commission. She is an expert in advocacy, community building, and legislative relations. And on a personal note, fantastic lady, very knowledgeable about <laughs> libraries and library services, not just in Georgia, but nationwide. We're fortunate to have her, Julie Walker. Thank you so much, Val. It is such a pleasure and privilege to be here with you all today, especially, as Val said, since I moved here in 1990. Thank you to Ms. Kathy Ames for hiring me <laughs> to come here to work in 1990 uh, and had a wonderful, wonderful stretch of years working here with this <coughs> incredible staff. Uh, at the Athens Regional Library and then continue to have that privilege with my work at the Georgia Public Library Service. This time last year I was in Hartwell on a Sunday afternoon presenting the Library of the Year Award to the Hart County Library and it was snowing <laughs> and today it's 70 degrees so welcome to Georgia where we keep you guessing. <laughs> but. Honestly, as you get weather in many varieties in Georgia, so do you get libraries in many varieties in Georgia. And I'm so fortunate to get to visit and work with and enjoy all 407 public libraries in Georgia, and they are all amazing. And they are all beloved and valued by their communities, and they are all with full parking lots and full computers and people walking out with stacks of books and it is just amazing the work that they're doing in every single community in Georgia and that's why it's so difficult for us to choose our library of the year recipient each year um, I am just so especially pleased to recognize the successes of this library system and its 11 wonderful libraries they are very clear in their roles of community engagement, academic achievement, diversity and inclusion. 
They take the time to think and communicate their shared values. I was honored to get to uh, work with them at their staff development day this year, and this, all the staffs of all the 11 libraries were here. And they devoted real time and effort to talking about and coming up with their shared values. And I think that's the reason that they do such a marvelous job and the reason that people who walk into those libraries are welcomed and are served with such dedication. So I, I see how this happens from the very, very beginning. I want to just share a few um, nuggets from this beautiful nomination that, that came into our agency for Athens Regional Library System to be our Library of the Year this year. The packet, I'm no kidding, this, this, this packet was amazing and so many letters of support. And if you are one of the people sitting in this auditorium who wrote a letter of support, we thank you. We had a wonderful time reading your words about what each of the, these libraries and this library system as a whole means to you and to your communities. The Athens Regional Library System proudly serves residents in five northeast Georgia counties with 11 branches and resource centers. From our smallest resource center to our largest headquarters branch, our patrons know that when they walk through our doors, they will find unique resources, innovative technology, and best of all, a knowledgeable staff who are passionate about helping people find what they need and improve their daily lives through the library's offerings. While each branch has its own personality and strengths, the branches combine into a system that is truly special and deserving of the 2017 Georgia Public Library of the Year Award. It was one of the things that really impressed our committee when we considered these nominations to see how the Athens Regional Library System works together, how the trustees, the friends, and the staff each care about each other and about the success of every single one of those branches. It is not a place where they're just a bunch of separate different buildings. They truly do work together and believe together. All branches of the Athens Regional Library System are deeply woven into the fabric of their individual communities. By engaging communities, our staff ensures that the library is an integral part of our local infrastructure and not just a nice thing to have. And of course, that is what we believe at the Georgia Library, Georgia Public Library Service. We understand that the libraries are the heart and soul and center of every community. And I think you all are helping me demonstrate that today by filling up this auditorium and cheering on this library system. We've heard a lot about some of the programs and partnerships that the Athens Regional Library engages in in every one of the five counties, and I'm not going to list them again, but they are truly amazing. I was especially proud to be at a national conference when they were awarded with the EBSCO Solar Grant to the only one of only two libraries in the world to receive the grant to construct a solar array on the library campus. That was a really thrilling moment. They've won a National Endowment for the Humanities Common Heritage Grant, which has gotten a lot of publicity and has really made us all look good in the bargain. As our committee considered nominations for this award, we were struck by how seamlessly these five counties, boards of trustees, and staff work together toward their goals of community service. It's clear that they support and cheer each other and encourage every location to reach higher. The number of heartfelt letters of nomination were impressive, and I, again, I greatly appreciate everyone who took the time to speak up for this library. Spectacular libraries don't happen without exceptional leadership. So trustees, up here with me on the, on the podium, you did a marvelous job when you selected Valerie Bell as your director. <laughs> Val and her team exhibit smart, enthusiastic leadership all over this library system, and I'm really thrilled that everybody's up here on stage together. The Athens Regional Library System has tremendous community support from partner organizations, local leaders, and patrons. They have been an integral part of Northeast Georgia's daily lives for decades, and we are excited to consider the possibility of how our system will continue to evolve to serve the patrons' needs. So it is truly my great pleasure to present Val and Jean and everybody up here on this stage with the 2017 Georgia Public Library of the Year Award.
kindly support this award with a check for $1,000. I just want to say thank you once again to all of our community partners who are here as well. Um, and some, I, I know that there's people here who help us uh, with all kinds of things. It takes a lot. So I want to thank everybody. If I didn't get to say your name, my heartfelt thanks still to you. Please join us in the meeting rooms for some afternoon refreshments and fellowship. Thank you all. Engaging communities, exceeding expectations. 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 Engaging communities, exceeding expectations.